Legality. Welcome back, yeah. Welcome back to the channel, guys. I'm Babyface P. As you see, we have a tantal. Um, I've been instructed to spend 30 seconds trying to not talk about certain things. So uh, let's try this. Uh, if you want to join a Patreon, it's down below. If you want to buy a t-shirt, it's down below. But check the comments. I, I, I'm always reading every comment that comes in. Uh, are we close to 10 seconds yet? I hate trying to read for 30 seconds. We're playing with the, uh, the the algorithm of certain things to see what happens and doesn't happen. So, anyways, we have this thing in front of me. Uh, this is the Polish Tantal that we've been working on. And it's ready. It's ready to test. We are going to be test firing this today. Um, we have some wolf ammo, I want to say. And this is my one of my Russian Bakelites. Fits nicely, it's a little snug, but it actually fits pretty nice. Clicks in pretty nicely. We might do a little trimming to make it a little bit better. Um, the stock, I know I crapped on this really hard last video. It's actually not as bad as I thought it was. It's not great. I still would bump up to a regular full stock or a nice uh, triangle salt side folder or something, but it's not bad. But um, we got uh, like 90 rounds of ammo. Put it on fire. Put my ears in, and let's just let's just blast off a couple and see. Will it run? What do you guys think? Leave a comment. Tell me, uh, is it gonna go boom boom or is it gonna fire? We'll see. Let's do it. You ready? It didn't blow up. Of course it didn't blow up. You guys know me. That is a soft, soft shooting gun. Um, this brake is incredible. Plus 545. Man, this thing is a treat to shoot. Let's shoot some distance. No sights. I haven't put the sights on. Uh, we did a pretty good job lining them up because obviously they're right on with the steel. Let's shoot past the tree. and it runs perfect. Let's put another mag in, run another 30, maybe get you guys some slow-mo. Let's see what we can do, all right. There is your Polish Tantal. We're not quite done. Obviously, you can see there's rust. It's ugly. We're not done yet. That truck will have to pass first. There is your Polish Tantal. This thing is, I gotta say, the more I shoot 545, the more I love it. It's just my favorite caliber. It's such a good caliber. Oh, it's soft, it's light, it's the same-ish as 556. It's just hard to get. Somebody, please bring in more 545. So, what was I saying? We're not quite done yet. We still have a little bit more. Needs to be refinished. We're gonna do a park on this gun and I'm gonna show you guys how to parkerize the gun. Um, not something you, nah, you could probably do it at home. We'll figure that out. Uh, I'm gonna do it in a professional setting. I'm gonna take it to Safety Harbor Firearms and use his park tanks. But if you have the same or similar equipment, you could probably make it work. We also are going to run the, uh, we have the VZ88, side rail that needs to be riveted in. So we're also gonna do a video on that. We will do that before we park it. We may do that after we park it. I'm not quite sure, cause I, I might, I probably wanna get the parking underneath it. So we'll probably park it and then add the side rail. Um, beyond that, this thing is freaking awesome. I know, I know it's hard to get parts kits these days when it comes to 545. 
if you come across one, if you come across any 545 parts kit, pick it up, build it, you won't be disappointed. 545, it's just so awesome. It's such a, ugh, everything about it. It's so awesome. So there you go, guys. I hope you liked it. We're not done. I will catch you guys on the next video. We will park this thing and make it look pretty. So stay tuned. That might be a couple weeks out. All right, I'll catch you guys later. See ya.